Yes, uh, you are seeing a, a part two tutorial of a single page application with a uh, knocker JS. So last session, uh, it is a part two, two continuation. So last session, I just uh, explained you how the basic um, single page application your menus is uh, working. So and uh, what technology it's been used. So I uh, just uh, declared a view model here so uh, the menus just to go through my uh, previous tutorial that i added in the playlist in the noco.js if you are not able to see you can find this in a description so uh, i'll flip this so last session i just end up with some error so what it is actually i try to build my menu but i got uh, some uh, issues uh, it's not even building actually so why this is uh, happened i just want to check mm, so i got uncaught at uh, type error unable to process the function menus why this is happened uh, because uh, yeah so directly i just pause the function but it's really not work uh, we need to declare a new function okay so this is actually uh, the view model uh, that i uh, declared here that new model instance we need to create so I didn't done that so maybe this is the first issue that I'm facing okay now in console there is a uh, no issues so if you go here so I go and uh, just keep because I didn't add any class to which item it's uh, actually it's been selecting see so so now the things is so uh, things is now uh, I need to make uh, this as uh, workable so how the things uh, going to work so now menu is got builder and uh, data also it's uh, added in, in the listings so I want to make uh, this menu uh, to be a uh, clickable so it is not happening now the reason is because of uh, some issues we'll look into that okay i going to add some css that i going to reference uh, from uh, noco.js website only so because already uh, the log.js app have set of uh, css that is represented so just a link from the, the that website so for uh, reference i'm taking but you go on to create yourself css style sheet okay good and to the next level I need to add a class for my class okay folders okay we'll uh, flip the page yep so now uh, menu is uh, menu styles is added here so uh, now I just want to make this menu to be work so once I click the same item it has to be uh, selectable uh, the same items uh, draft means draft so how to fix this uh, we already written the code but it's not really working now so we'll look that why this is happened okay it's a menu let it be there as menu okay go to menu okay we go to the code and we'll uh, review it what was the issue oops oh it's a uh, double quote double equal to so that one issue is uh, there so we'll refresh the page Oops, now this is working fine. Wow, well, uh, now it's so uh, I'm able to uh, do my menu selectable. So, uh, this is what uh, the things is uh, working fine. I just to uh, explain you shortly what I did uh, uh, done before. If you're not understanding, able to understand it. So, I'm trying to create the menu so uh, i don't want to redirect if i click uh, send items draft uh, trashes 
so what I build I just want my application to be a single app so on selectable by using the hash based uh, navigation mechanism I want to make uh, this to be selected so that is what I trying to do from the initial stage so what I did I dynamically created my menus so I just want to create a ID of the menu ID is nothing but what the menus uh, directly we can I want to push uh, into the chosen ID so on click of uh, the li okay uh, menu uh, that menu so uh, I asked that uh, to call this function this function hold that apply uh, whatever the menu that uh, selector default that push to the chosen ID so uh, k observable it will take uh, into the account and it will find the particular uh, data that what I uh, what the event uh, receiving so that will hold in the chosen ID so uh, selected CSS equal to the data what data if uh, equal to the text then it has to be selected that is what the condition I applied if I want to select this one so my data data it will hold the particular suppose inbox so inbox equal to choose an ID is inbox then it, this will apply as uh, the CSS as selected so selected CSS uh, that will be like that that active mode so that is what I done uh, so far so guys uh, so you got it how to uh, make the menu to be selected from the Noco JS. just go on to try this completely by watching the part 1 and part 2 tutorial and come back if you have any doubts queries we'll uh, go uh, to the next level of the stuffs in a future video just stay tuned the same playlist to get more stuff uh, with the Noco JS. so thanks for watching the video guys please uh, stay tuned if you not subscribe our channel please subscribe to get a more updates related with what you are watching currently Thanks for watching the video guys.